What is your definition of life? Some say life is an assignment. Some say life is a war. Life is a symphony. Life is music. Life is a dance. What say? Some say life is a journey. Jesus said in Hebrews 10, Lo, I come, as is written about me in the volume of the book. Jesus considered his life as an assignment. And he said, I have finished the task that you have given me. So it's like an assignment that you need to be intentional about living each day. Ibuko Awashika shared a story. When she was the chairman of First Bank, at that time, there was a position vacant to head First Bank in another country. While the interview process was going on to interview a candidate, they went through the process, picked the, you know, the top candidate, sent to her for an interview, asked her PA to, you know, put things together and set up an interview. The day came, interviewed this man and she found him a good fit. She looked at his CV and he qualified. She found him a good fit. After the interview, she prayed for him, gave him her blessings and sent him off. Thereafter, he was transferred to that country to head the bank. Shortly after, the committee that was set up to establish this process and to pick a candidate came to her and said, Oh, we made a mistake. Right person for this position wasn't interviewed. The person you interviewed was the second candidate. The first candidate, for some reason, we missed him. Please, can we reschedule another interview for you to interview him? And she paused and said, no, I won't do that. I already gave him my blessings. I won't reverse it. In retrospect, she thought something happened here. She called her assistant and asked, go find out. This man must have a praying person in his life. It's either a praying wife or a praying mother. Distant came back a few days later and showed her the picture of the man and his wife on Facebook. And he, she said, and the wife had no makeup on and she looked like a believer. And she said, ah, I want deeper life. This one goes to deeper life church. This woman has prayed this money. Can you imagine that? She considered her role as the chairman as a tool, his tenure ended, and instead of returning back to Nigeria, he wrote a letter and sent to her, my family and I, we've moved to Canada. And she wished him well. What am I trying to say here? Life is an assignment. Whatever position you find yourself, it might be a job, it might be in your home as a wife, it might be as a husband, it might be as a brother, it might be as a doctor, whatever position you may find yourself in, consider it as an assignment you are going to give an account of your life. Let each day count intentional. Be deliberate, mindful. Whatever you start, work on finishing that task. Work on completing the project and stop. When you start, be sure to finish. I run a class. It's called the Rehoboth Masterclass. This is a 12-week intensive discipleship course intended to provide real-life insights mentorship, deepen your walk with God. One of the testimonials from the Rehoboth Masterclass, the lady said, I just realized that I had the savior complex, but from this course, I learned this savior complex, I need to cut it off. I put the information you will need to register in the description box below. Be sure to go in there and then register. Until then, I'll see you next time.